Hundreds of people came together at St George's Hall on Sunday morning to remember those who fought for us, protected us and died for our freedom. Led by Liverpool's Lord Mayor, this year's service also marked the 70th anniversary of the Battle of the Atlantic, which was the longest military campaign of the Second World War. Many people left the ceremony overwhelmed by the respect shown. However, Mick was reminded of the bleak reality he faced less than a year ago when serving as a sniper for the British Army. Um, well, <laughs> I was laying a, a bomb roof for my friend. He died to save my life in Kosovo. We uh, we were patrolling and we got ambushed. Uh, one of my other friends um, got shot. And my friend Logan, my best friend, he was acting sergeant, and um, he told everyone to get behind cover and stay there. But my friend, who'd already been shot, was literally right in front of me, and he was, you know, he was saying, "Make help me." So uh, I disobeyed the order to try and help my friend. And as I did that, Morgan ran out from where he was, because he was my best friend. And uh, as he got probably a metre in front of me, I just, um, I just saw him fall towards me and caught him. And a sniper had shot him in the back of the head. So I had all this blood all over my face. And <sighs> so I blamed myself for it because if I'd have listened to him in the first place, I wouldn't have happened to him. I went through so much with Logan. You know, we uh, we got captured in Kosovo and we got tortured for 10 days. And he was the one that kept me strong through all of that. He he was my rock. And when he died, just, my world fell apart, basically. Um, to be honest, it was probably the best Remembrance Day service I've ever seen. Um, just the amount of people that turned up. You know, when, when everyone was marching off and the whole crowd was applauding, it was it just felt so good that you know, there are actually people who do support us and do back us up. The ceremony not only remembered the heroes of years ago, but also reminded us of the heroes still fighting to protect our country to this very day. You get the sun was shining, but there seems to be more people this year. It just gets me that so many people, young people anyway. To see so many people here, it's, uh, I think it's lovely. When you come here, you start thinking about the people you've lost. You know, not just through the conflict, but you've lost family members you know, through the years. And we've recently, uh, the last couple of years, lost my father. So, I mean, the thoughts drift back to, 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 to him and his people who has gone before. Yeah, it's been, most of the earth has been drier. <laughs> In this world and the next.